I wanted to be one of the f at least few people to really capture the arcades closing. I didn't know how to adjust the light settings and all of that, but you know, I just was like, fuck it, if, if it comes out blurry, I'm just gonna take it, because it's gonna be the last time I see a lot of these people. You know, I knew I wasn't gonna see most of them after that, so. This is, this is my homegirl, Sarah. She was like one of the people I used to play DDR with. She used to like kind of train me in it. This is my old, one of my oldest friends too, Tori. It's funny because he's like actually one of the best DDR players in there right now. <laughs> he doesn't look like it though. Like he, he's a bouncer at a club. So you never would think that a bouncer at a club would play DDR, but he plays it because he just don't care. It's just a game. Like, is it going to hurt somebody, you know? It was, it was a pretty grimy place, but that's kind of why I liked it. It kind of captured that, like, old New York feel, which was basically grime. I'm born into that, so it was not a problem for me at all. I, I kind of liked it the way it looked. I remember, like, walking into it, and I would just be so excited to see somebody there that I knew. I'm like, yes, the night's going to be great. <laughs> 